officiated the wedding. I didn't think I'd have to give a best man speech. <laughs> so we're going to see how I do. Uh, improvise in from the heart. Um, as I said earlier, I've known Derek since I was a little kid. Uh, we went to high school dances together. I uh, we went to college together. I, we were in the room earlier getting ready and I was telling Derek, it's funny how things end up taking a certain course of events. I remember I was changing colleges at one point and I decided to go from USC in Los Angeles to the University of California, Santa Barbara, to Santa Barbara. And that's where Derek was. Yeah. If you're improvising a speech, just go directly for the alumni of the college room, too. It's a good way to get some cheers. And I called Derek up immediately. And I said, Derek, I'm, uh, I'm, next year I'm going to UC Santa Barbara. And without any hesitation, without asking me what I want to do, he's like, cool, I'll start looking for an apartment for us. And he's always been that kind of faithful guy. He's always been worried about me. And uh, he's one of the most loyal guys I know in that respect. We've all, there's one, I'm not going to lie to you, there's only one re reason I would visit Reno. <laughs> Sorry for all the guys that live there. <laughs> if you ever want to get booed at the wedding, by the way, just insult the, <laughs> the hometown of some people. But uh, you were uh, living with you. I remember I then asked Taylor, I, met, uh, I saw him at a coffee shop. Taylor and I and Derek went to high school together. And I was at Starbucks studying, and I asked Taylor, I said, uh, you remember Derek Sully? He said, yeah, I'm like, I'm moving in with him, we need a third roommate. You know, do you want to move in with us? And he was like, yeah, absolutely, without a flinch. And then he moved from Irvine, California, to Santa Barbara, California, and uh, then we had uh, an apartment chimney sweeps together, and it was the probably one of the more fun years of my life. I was rooming with my three best friends, and it was absolutely amazing. And uh, that's uh, a story between Derek and us. Uh, but what I'd say this about Derek. Um, you're the most loyal guy I know. You, the amount you can love is just unbelievable. And I know that you will be an amazing husband, a wonderful loving father, and I'm jealous of the kids you have because I cannot, Derek is the guy who if his kid is playing soccer, and he thinks that his kid, you know, was inbound instead of out of bounds. Not only will he throw the chair at the ref, he'll start punching the guy and, and, complain, and complaining the entire time about why he should be kicked out of every game from here from now on. But uh, I can't imagine someone better to have as a friend, uh, to have as a husband, and to have as a father. So, if we can all raise our glasses. To the new bride, to the new husband, to a beautiful new family, to love, to happiness, to time. Time. Time.